In this video, I'm going to show you how to back up your WordPress website. There are two methods to do this. If you have the access to the cPanel, make sure that you save the files and that's basically it. Have an automatic saver inside of your cPanel. But I'm supposing that you don't have access to a cPanel right here. What we are going to use is a plugin. So head to the plugin section on the left corner, click on add new. Select the search tab on the top right corner. Click search for backup. What we're going to use is a Jetpack, Jetpack backup or this one, Updraft. Those are the two recommended ones. I'm going to use the Updraft in this case and let's go with it. Once you have bid that, click activate. And now you're going to be prompted to here. Click on press here to start. Keep in mind to back up your website, you will either have to choose Dropbox, Google Drive or something like that. I'm going to show you how to configure it. You can click on next or settings right here. You can have files to backup and schedule. You can choose what you where you would like to save it. So for example, FTP is going to be have an, an FTP that you'll have to log in, in an email. For example, this won't work as most emails won't accept large files, Google Cloud, I suggest just using either Google Drive or Dropbox. Click on Google Drive and then click on sign in with Google, leave this page and sign in with your Google account. After successfully doing that, click back up now and actually choose this, allowing this backup to be deleted manually. Click back now and then your backup should start. This is how to successfully back up your website and make sure that even if your website get deleted, you will be able to re-upload it and be good to go. Once you have done, as you can see, the backup has finished running. You can go ahead to your backup, which you're going to find right here. Choose either databases, plugins, themes, uploads, and you can even click download to your computer. As you can see right here, my download start. You can even click on restore and this will restore everything that you have done. I'm going to cancel this as it's the same thing. That's basically it, guys. Thanks for watching and goodbye.